Alert! Hostile ship locked onto our location. Prepare to engage. You are watching the number one show everyone knows and loves, Cooking with Sarge. Today is a special episode. We'll be making one of my favorites, calamari gumbo with a glass of Rincol. Here's what you need. Start by washing the squid, cutting the wings and removing the skin. Cut below the eyes and dispose the innards. Separate the tentacles and keep them whole. Running the knife blunt end along the head to get everything out. Clean your chopping board and throw away the guts. Wash again to remove any unwanted extras and slice into rings and place into a bowl. Next, start removing the prawns from their shells. Twist and pull the head off. Gently squeeze the top and bottom between your fingers and run down the body to release the meat from the shell, making it easier to peel. Run the knife along the prawn and remove the black vein. Wash them and add them to the bowl with a squid. Add lemon juice and place into the fridge for 30 minutes. Meanwhile, prepare your area to fry the calamari. You will need two plates, one with three tablespoons of flour, and the other with the remaining flour, plus the paprika, cayenne pepper, and a pinch of salt. Also, a bowl for the milk. Once the squid has had 30 minutes in the lemon juice, drain and place onto the flour-only plate, coating evenly, then transfer into the milk and then onto the other plate. Start to heat up a pan with roughly half an inch of oil on a high heat. Once the oil is really hot, carefully fry the calamari for approximately five minutes until crispy. Place onto paper towels to remove any grease and put to the side for later. Boil the kettle. Meanwhile, begin to make the gumbo. Slice and dice your vegetables. Once the kettle has boiled, in a jug, add the fish sauce and beef stock to 500 milliliters of water. Put a pan on a medium-high heat with a splash of oil. Add the onions, ginger, and garlic paste and a pinch of salt. After a couple of minutes, the onions will start to soften. Bring the heat up to high. Add the prawns. And once they are almost cooked, Add the peppers and the celery. Give everything a good stir and once the peppers begin to soften, add the soy sauce. After 30 seconds, add the stock and bring to the boil. When it begins boiling, reduce the heat to low and lid the pan for 30 minutes. After 25 minutes, start to make the rin call. You will need ice, orange juice, midori, and absinthe. Add ice, two parts midori, 
one part absinthe, and two parts of orange juice. Shake in a cocktail mixer and strain into a glass. Back to the gumbo. Remove the lid and add the calamari and serve with a sprig of parsley. Hell, if this was my last day on this ship, I'd die happy.